Hello everyone at Pinso Lewis College and at Carhartt. My name is Chelsea Bundick and I'm applying for the footwear design program. So a little bit about our consumer. I'm designing for the Detroit Tigers groundskeeping crew. Uh, so a little bit more about what they're going to be doing on a day-to-day -day basis. Uh, they're going to have a lot of different activ activities, which is why the, one of the main problems is their day-to-day -day activities. They don't really know exactly sometimes how it's going to be, whether it's going to be on the grass, whether they're going to be working on clay, or even during a game when there's going to be a rain delay um, and you have to pull out a tarp. Uh, those are the type of things that you're going to have on a day-to-day -day basis in terms of problems. And how we want to solve that is we're going to have a versatile type of upper, which can actually be able to modify itself to be an internal shoe, but it also has an outer uh, covering that's going to fit like a boot, but it's also going to be an optional type of suspension in terms of lacing. So if you want that added extra inch, basically, to provide that boot support, you can lace it up to a boot height. But um, you can also just use the in internal uh, structure to just make it more like a sneaker feel. And then also when they're day-to-day -day basis, they're going to do a lot of, say, heavy lifting, carrying bags, quick dry, uh, any of that kind of matter. And you're going to need a lot more uh, support, basically, for like, heavy lifting, which comes to the next problem, which is more like so a collapsed arch or compressive type of midsole. And the way we're going to solve that is we're going to have a reinforced archway as well as have a outsole that's going to more of a more neutral or more flat lie more outwards towards the toe and towards the heel just to give it more like a weightlifting type of shoe where it has a more stable base um, you don't have to be kind of standing just on the balls of your feet or just on the heels it's going to have a nice full foot feel um, now so when we look at the actual shoe what does it actually speak out to in, in terms of carhartt I went for a more simplicity type of actual silhouette, but of course, when you deep dive into it, it's gonna have a lot more complicated or complex type of design, but it's gonna be more versatile. It's gonna be very durable, which is one of the key things that Carhartt always has kept with them. Um, it can do a lot of things. It can do and withstand a lot of things, which is why it's gonna be great for the Detroit Tigers. Um, that clay can be kind of harsh sometimes on a shoe. That, um, that high heat can be a lot so that's why this internal shoe is going to, um, the internal upper is going to be very breathable. It's also going to be uh, water resistant and water repellent. But then also the actual exterior leather is going to be the actual construction and material. But it's going to be a waterproof type of leather that's going to have a nice uh, film. But then also a uh, toe guard or mud guard uh, that's going to be a high abrasion resistant type of material. As well as on the actual heel cup or heel clip, excuse me. So... This shoe will be able to actually provide a lot for this um, groundskeeping crew, um, but it's also going to be able to be worn all, all day, basically. Uh, it's going to have an actual carbon plate uh, shank in the actual underfoot to provide a little more energy to their step, but also provide some suspension and support to help alleviate some of that pressure and that weight on your foot for a long hour durations. I would like to say, like, I'm very excited for this program. Um, I'm very passionate about footwear design. I really do believe as well as Carhartt and functional design, I want to be able to design stuff that's going to help people do their jobs better, help make it look easier or feel easier on their body because I want them to be able to go home at the end of the day and still have the energy, still have the ability to live their lives, you know, not just live just at work, but also be able to live um, wherever you are doing or everything that you're doing. Um, also, one thing about myself. I've been recently been I've been working at Academy Sports and Outdoors. I've actually been working as a footwear sales, but I've been working very closely as into work boots, service boots. Uh, I've been working very closely with customers and experiencing what they need and what they don't need in actual safety toes, and the kind of complications that they've been running into on a vast uh, variety of types of jobs, whether it would be warehouse jobs, construction jobs, or even just they want like say service for police officers or for um, actual working in correctional offices and stuff like that. So I feel like this program was actually something that would fit perfectly for me. Um, I think that it's going to be a great opportunity. I also have played baseball in my, in my past, so uh, it kind of fits pretty well with me. So I'm kind of excited to see where I can go with this. But I um, hope you guys like my design. I'm looking forward to seeing you all in the future. Thanks.